What's up, cat, tiger? And today we're making Yuna's Obi. That is that big giant yellow piece that goes around her stomach. So first, we're making the pattern. And we're going to look up a picture of her Obi because we don't exactly remember how it's supposed to look. So first thing you do, gather your reference material. Or don't. Or make it up as you go along. That's fine too. Yeah. No, seriously though, you guys, reference yeah. materials are important. So the first thing we do is we sketch out what it looks like based on the reference picture. And then from there, we sort of start unraveling it and basing the pattern. And we make a rough sketch of the pattern. And then we measure and make notes. And then we make a life-size pattern and then cut the fabric. The cool thing about making the sketch first is you kind of get a sense of how whatever you're trying to make kind of functions and how it kind of feels, how it looks, three-dimensionally anyway, as opposed to just looking at some, something and kind of guessing where things go. If you sketch it, you can kind of feel like, okay, it goes under and then there's a bow here and then there's another thing and blah, 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 blah. So I, I recommend doing sketches first. Not just helps you figure out where seam lines go, and, and it's easy to look at something and go, hey, that's a bow, but what kind of bow? There are many types of bows. So we have decided that what we're going to do is we're going to make it so that so that the wrap of the OB, the part that goes around the middle, is shaped like this. It's cut in half, and it'll wrap around and will attach in the back. And on one side of the wrap, the bow itself, the entire structure will be sewn onto that one end so that when it goes around, all we have to do is maybe either put the other end inside of the bow and then that'll just Velcro down or just bam right just on, on top of the bow. It's fine. Or behind the bow. Still. So we're going to figure out that part out later. But for now, we're going to make it. Yeah! <laughs> Go team! So first we're going to measure the um, the middle bit. So what we're doing, since we're doing Velcro, um, we're actually going to measure my waist while I'm sitting down. Because, I mean, you get that feeling when you're in a tight pair of jeans when you're standing up. It's like it, they're a little bit slimmer, and then you sit down and all of a sudden you got like five billion muffin tops. So I feel you have them. Yes! <laughs> So exactly basically what we're doing is we're measuring her gut at its biggest mm -hmm. so that she'll be comfortable all day at a convention. Yes. And that way, because the Velcro is not like a super intense class system, it won't just come apart when I sit down because that would suck. Alright, so we've decided on 36 inches by 8 inches. So what we're going to do make is... Make a giant rectangle. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, Cat and I can make a rectangle. <laughs> The chair keeps coming, the bar on the chair keeps coming out. It keeps doing it. Do you want to switch chairs? No! <laughs> you sure? It's fine. You need your butt to work. <laughs> I feel like this happened at the party. We had a party. That was a mistake. No, it wasn't. It was, it was our first ever real people party with real people, like more than five. <laughs> we had six people. We had more than that. Eight. Yeah, we had like, no, we had like ten people. <laughs> it was wild, guys. <laughs> So wild. Uh, cat and tiger party animals. There's the rectangle. Alright, so we've cut it out. Now we're gonna pin it to the fabric. That is my weapon of choice. The fabric! By the way, guys, all the fabric that you're saying looks nothing like what you're saying. Did not need this much fabric for the OB. Okay, so. Either we did not buy gold thread or we lost our gold thread. I'm pretty sure we lost our gold thread because why the fuck would we not have bought <laughs> gold thread? To be fair, I do not remember buying gold thread. I, I swear. Alright, well anyway, the point is we do not have gold thread. We will have to go and buy gold thread and the fabric store is closed. And we will have to do that tomorrow. So we will see you in a couple of seconds in different clothing. We're back! Hi! <laughs> <laughs> With gold thread. Woo! Yes. And now we were sewing. Okay, so to make that circle part that goes around that holds the bow in, we're basically just gonna be making this exact thing again. So we got the first part of the Obi. So we're just gonna be making another one of these for the loop. Mm -hmm. And then continue to basically do the same thing to get the, the bow pieces. And then we're gonna paint it the same way we painted the skirt. Till next time. Boop.